Well, the people at Discount Drug Mart are being stupid now. I think their heads are spinning, and they don't know which, what they're doing. Because there's one pharmacy down the road here called Job's Pharmacy. They closed. So now they're getting inundated by the customers that was going there. Long story short, last, yesterday was Wednesday and our foot doctor, John Olivario, ordered two creams for Renee. Well, actually this is a special lotion for Renee. And uh, anyhow, it's a special lotion for Renee for her leg and her foot and also she has an eardrop she's all supposed to have in her ear because uh, she uh, have been uh, uh, well she had two put in her ear and she's been having infection now in her ear Long story short, she ran out on Monday of the eardrops because they said uh, we must be, I must have been putting too much uh, drops in her ear or squirting too much in her ear. We couldn't get the eardrops until today. I called this morning they said they were filling it. And then last night, the thing is, yet, not yesterday, I stopped in to get the medicine from Dr. John Olivario, and they only had one cream, an antibiotic cream. And then uh, I called back and told them, hey, there's supposed to be two uh, prescriptions, and they said, oh yeah, uh, I see it here in the computer and we'll fill it, and it should be done in about 45 minutes, they said, last night. Well, good thing I didn't come in last night because, in fact, they didn't even have it ready. They didn't have it ready when I came in to get the airdrops. I, I, I raised my voice. Don, the uh, uh, old pharmacist that was here, the young guy taking Don's place, No, this one girl thought uh, I was wanting to get Renee's uh, sink her meds meds already, and I, I understand that doesn't she think of those until the middle of the month. I wasn't one of those. I was wanting the meds that was ordered for her for her ear from my from my Dr. Gehring and uh, other medicine for, was ordered for her, her leg and her foot. From uh, Dr. John Olivello. Anyway, uh, 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 they were being stupid. I raised my voice in there and told them, hey, you know, this is BS. You, you know, nothing like this happened when uh, Don was working here. Oh, there was a few mess ups, but not like this when they tell you one thing and they tell you something else and they tell you something else. They're not telling you, they're not being straight. Well, I gotta get going down here to pay the water bill and... Okay, that is a short video I did while I was still in my van, while I was at the pharmacy. So that's what we'll do for an hour or so. By the way, this is uh, Evangelist Dr. Robert McKim Sr. from Carrollton, Ohio. Uh, yeah, got home with her meds. People are being so stupid. Yesterday, when I stopped into the Job and Family Services, 
office to drop off two uh, papers for uh, our doctor's appointments to get uh, gas to go for the doctor's appointments that we went to. There's other people in there waiting and they had numbers. Now get this. They have numbers that are actually children's flashcards. And they have a sign that there's people ahead of you. Pick a number. I was number seven. And, well, this one lady was up at the window. I had number six. I had number seven. So basically, I was the last one. And then this other lady comes in. I told politely that I'm number seven, that she would have to get, uh, you know, a number. And she says, oh, you can wait. I just got to drop off this envelope. I'm like, people. I'm like, I I'm ahead here, and I got to wait? And then she says, oh, if you were black, you would be right up there at the window right now. Um, I said, not really. The nerve of some people today. They, they don't care if you're ahead of them or not. They, they don't care if they mess up. And, uh, and, and uh, they just don't. I understand that there's so much going on in this world today. All this killing. ISIS, uh, you know, people that are sympathizing with ISIS here in the United States, killing other people, and in other countries like, uh, you know, Paris, France. I, you know, but pe people don't have to be so stupid and treat people with disrespect. Yeah, I raised my voice and I told him, hey, if Don was here, you know. A pharmacy here in town, Job's Pharmacy closed. I didn't know that they closed until I saw a sign up here at the Discount Drug Mart. Welcoming, you know, uh, the customers of Job's Pharmacy. And, but last night, the girl said... When I called back, when I got home with the, the cream that the Renee, the antibiotic cream that Dr. Johnny O'Reilly ordered, Renee said, no, there's supposed to be two creams. Not one, but two. Because Heather told her that there was two. I called back up there and I told the girl, Heather told Renee on the phone that there was two. She said, okay, I see it here on the computer and I'll fill it. And it should be done in 45 minutes to an hour. I said, well, I would be up around 8 o'clock or after to get... Well, I didn't. And then, so I go up to day thinking, hey, it's done filled. But wasn't filled. The only thing that was filled was the airdrops. Or where's the other medicine from Dr. John Alvario? And then the, the, the girl, the blonde haired girl that works there was telling this uh, guy uh, tech that they have now. Well, then that won't be ready until the 6th. I'm like, what is she talking about? What won't be ready until the 6th? Well, Renee gets her, her other medications all on the 6th. That are through what's called Sync Your Meds, where she gets all her meds on a specific day of the month. I understand that they don't. She don't get those until the sixth, but she should get what the other doctors ordered when he ordered it. Not wait, make her wait until the sixth to get those too. But. They're being stupid up there. So I'm going to call the corporate office for a discount drug mark. 
and tell him that uh, my nose is stuffed up. Now they're being stupid here. No, no, Dawn's not here. Oh, Paige can't be found. What's going on here? Say, I'm having problems too, dear. I got the number. Well, I want, you know, programming us in. Yeah, time is short, and uh, it's getting shorter, because Jesus is coming back soon. He is coming back very, very soon. See, a lot of people don't understand. We are going to be persecuted for three and a half years. Christians are going to be persecuted and turned over to authorities for three and a half years. I'm I'm wanting to I'm wanting to see something here if this works. Alright, hon. I got the number right here. Uh contact us right here. Alright, where's the phone? Did you give it to me? Okay. Service. Now your party's extension, you may dial 8, followed by their four-digit extension number. To access a dial by name directory, press 1. For department directory, press 2. For customer service, including pro points, I guess they're, press 3. Yeah. Customer service and pro points. Thank you for calling Discount Drug Mart Customer Service. You may also contact us at discount-drugmart.com forward slash contact us. This call may be recorded for quality assurance purposes. Oh, yeah, I'm being short. For help with pro points, Some medicine. Our Courtesy Plus Rewards Program, please have your courtesy card ready and press 1. If you have questions about a prescription, including a bill you received, press 2. For all other customer service issues, including issues with our website, please press 3. Your call is being forwarded to a short hell voicemail system. Wendy, visit is out of the office, please leave a message at the tone. When finished, you may hang up or press pound for additional options. Hello, this is uh, Robert McKim, M, small c, capital K, small i, small m, 330-627-0525. Wanted to talk to somebody about discount drug mark in Carrollton, Ohio, and uh, how they're sorting me a week supply of my uh, generic Nexium because uh, a couple three months ago I just had asked how much a week supply would cost if I could come up with the money to pay for the Nexium uh, regular Nexium that I was taking. And she looked it up on the computer, and I guess the computer is now sinking. For some reason, I got a week's supply, 
and I didn't get the week supply. And now they're shorting me a week supply. And also on top of that, I wanted to talk to somebody about how they are acting now. Uh, about, yeah, well, last night they said they was filling some medication and I went in to get some medication for Renee, R-E-N-E -E Jackson. And they only had one filled and she was told by Heather that works there that there would be two. But there was only one when I went there to pick it up. And I called back, and this one girl said uh, she would. It, she saw it was on the computer, and she would fill it. I could pick it up like in an hour. Well, I didn't go in. Good thing I didn't go in, cause they didn't even have it ready today when I went in about an hour, hour and a half ago to get it and some other medication as well. And uh, they uh, said it was just came in on the truck. And I'm like, well, why did they say last night that they was going to fill it last night? And on top of that, this other girl thought I was wanting to get Renee's sink her meds meds already. And I'm like, yeah, I know she's not do those yet. Just want to get the medicine that she was prescribed yesterday and get her eardrops today as well since Don's not working there they are really goofing up big time they're not being straight with us again the number is 330-627-0525 thanks bye well as always, not getting a hold of a person. My ne my my new generic form of Nexium uh, starts with an E. Basically, they're giving me only twenty three pills this month and last month. They gave me twenty three pills. But the months before that, they were giving me 30 of the regular Nexium. And I'm um, like, I asked them, I uh, took my medicine in uh, earlier here. Uh, actually, it was last month. Stopped in. I said, Why are you guys giving me 23? Because the computer thought you got a week supply uh, here a while back. And she said, Well, when they're due again, what, uh, say you want 30. But then they'll probably say I like, won't be able to get them right away because uh, if I want 30, if I want 23, maybe I can get them right away. But if I want 30, they'll probably say, well, you can't get them right now. You'll have to wait. Because it seems like insurance only wants to fill prescriptions. <coughs> so many days before they're due. And no no more than that. Long story short, it is getting really messed up. Really highly messed up now that Don is not working there. Well, listen, I'm going to get off here for now. There's a lot going on in this world. It's getting crazier and crazier and crazier because of ISIS. All these terrorists, rather homegrown terrorists or domestic terrorists. And then rumors of wars. People are going crazy everywhere, even, even you know, locally. God bless you. Have a blessed day.